Hello everyone. Thank you for joining me again for another message of the Hope Dealer by Caitlin Caddy. What a clever lady. Um, today's message is busyness is not a badge of honor. Busyness is not synonymous with worthiness. Busyness is not a status symbol. So let's stop treating it as that. Let's stop making busy our default response to the question, how have you been? Busy. It's not only a lazy and boring way of summing up our lives, but it creates an internal climate of overwhelm and perpetuates the, culture, the cultural conditioning of fatigue and burnout. You don't need an excuse, a reason or permission to rest. You don't owe us an explanation. You don't need to wait until you get sick to stop. You don't need to wait until you're burned out to take a break. Reclaim agency over your energy. Ride your cycles of vitality like the waves they are. Revel against the artificial currents of urgency and importance. Rest is an inherent part of the natural world. All around us, things ebb, flow, rise, fall, frost, melt, shine and hibernate. As human beings, why would we be excluded from this law of nature? Rest is rich with merit, and yet our contemporary culture has discouraged us from having it, instructing us to override our instincts and push forwards in a perpetual hustle. We've gone so far as to turn busyness into a badge of honor and to twist rest into a source of shame. But that's a losing proposition. We're overriding our natural rhythms instead of embracing their wisdom. When we should be rising and falling like the seasons, the moon, the tides, we're burning ourselves out, buzzing and flickering erratically like cheap neon lights. We've forgotten how to rest. In fact, many of us are downright scared of rest. And yet, without rest, we can't really do, be, or achieve our best. So let's reclaim rest, shall we? Because we all do our best when we let ourselves rest. And that reminded me about um, the seasons, um, like autumn. Autumn is a time of rest. The trees have to shed their old leaves, hibernate, have a bit of a rest, regenerate, so that they can flourish again and grow brand new leaves and fruits and flowers in the springtime. So why are we not allowing ourselves to have that rest? So I'm going to leave you today with um, three inspirational thoughts and positive affirmations that you might like to say to yourself and remind yourself. So one of them is, today I will spend time being peaceful. Today I will allow myself and I will give myself time to be peaceful. Today, I allow myself to rest and be peaceful. So give yourself permission to find a few minutes during the day to rest, take a breath, look out the window, look outside and be peaceful. Today, I choose to spend time paying attention to what is happening in the now. Lots of times we do get so busy that we don't stop and we don't have a rest. 
and we don't pay attention to what's happening around us or listening to what's happening around us right now. So that's being mindful. Practicing mindfulness is to actually close your eyes, take a big breath in, take three big breaths in, or go outside, look at the trees, depends of where you are. Pay attention for just a few seconds. Start practicing just a few seconds, a few minutes, just removing yourself from what you're doing and practicing just being in the moment. Let me know if that makes a difference because I know that it will. Okay, everybody, thank you for, for being with me until the end. Uh, remember, like, share and subscribe because it really helps me to get these messages out and to help as many people as possible. Thank you. Bye for now.